Welcome back, everyone. Hope your day is going well. Hope it hasn't been too rough. We are starting up Biomutant. We're going to go ahead and start recording this game. I've played it a little bit um, before, whenever it like, first came out. So I'm hoping it has gotten a little bit better since you know patches and potentially you know extra content. So we're going to skip that. And we got the PS5 version too. When I played it before, it was on the PS4 version. How can something as beautiful as this be dying? A plague is ruining the land, but the tree of life still stands. Question is, for how long? End is coming to the new world. The tribes stand divided, in need of someone strong enough to unite them, or bring them all down. This is a story with an unusual beginning. So, let's expect an unusual end. Okay, let's well, start. Bio -mutant. Yep. Um, let's go new game. Let's just go medium. Okay, so we get to create our character. Encode your DNA. Okay, so we have... I kind of want the one who has the best loot chance. Yeah, I think this one, the Murgle. Look at that loot chance, 5% there. Primal looks like does like that Dumden. Yeah, so I think I want Murgle. We lose a little bit of intellect, but that's fine. Define your character's starting attributes. A more detailed explanation. Define your genetic structure. Okay. Oh. What gives me better? Does anything... Oh, oh, okay, so what do you want your stuff to be in? Okay. You go straight up melee damage, but then we lose out on other stuff. Oh, yeah, barter, okay. Move speed. Charisma. <laughs> Intellect, agility. I feel like I kind of want in between on strength and agility. Or should we do strength and vitality? A little bit of damage and more health. Or agility and intellect. Yeah, see, that's all key stuff with the intellect. I think I want. 
probably, I feel like I kind of just want straight up strength to do a lot of melee damage. Then my vitality goes down. We could do strength and vitality. Although strength and agility looks good too. See, I don't know. I think we go... I think about right there. I want strength and vitality. I don't really care too much about charisma. So we'll just do this for now. Maybe... Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah, 70-40. I like that. Because I don't think you can do luck, right? Yeah, no, it just has those. Choose a genetic resilience. Mm, okay. Um, I, I think I want all. Yeah. Oh, wait. I'm trying to remember. I think Biohazard has quite a lot. I guess heat, cold, radioactivity. I don't remember. We'll just we'll just go straight up in the middle. It's fine. I'm, I'm okay with having all of them. Choose your first style. First style. Oh, that's right. Okay, so we got this now. I think I want like this. Feels like it's a little bit like Zangus. I like that. Okay, if I go randomize, what is it? Yeah, see, it's just got all the different ones. Yeah. I don't think there's any difference if I move that. So yeah, right here's fine. Pick your main color. Oh, this is oh, okay. Yeah, so this is legit. That ooh. Maybe we go purple. A little bit darker, though. Choose your detail color. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Hmm. Pick your main color. Um, main color. Honestly, we maybe just go straight up white. Choose your detail color. Detail color, though. Can't really tell what. I mean, I think this is more purple, right? So you can't really tell. Oh wait, this looks like it's a little more purple. Yeah, it wouldn't be towards red for more purple. It'd be down here. Yeah, I see, I'm not really sure. I think right there, that kind of looks purplish. Yeah, that kind of looks purple. I wish it was that darker purple like over there to the left. Oh wait, is that the purple that I kind of want? That looks purple actually, yeah, that darker color. Yeah, I think that's fine. Let's Pick make a back color. one. Let's maybe go a little bit golden if we can. Or do we just want straight up white? Yeah, I think we just want white. Or do we want yellow? 
No, we won't wait. Okay. Cool. Jeez, we spent like Choose 10 minutes just doing that. Color. Okay, that's fine. Pick a class. Okay, here we go. Pick Mercy. a class. Okay. Twin silver grip. Melee dual wield skill. Could do different one hand weapons. It wants to deal them. Melee weapons inflict 10% more damage to the target. Okay, it's not bad. Dead eye. Your range weapons are reloading instantly. Your next one, you're going to get 20% damage. Okay. Commander. Your range weapon attacks inflict like 10% more damage to the target. Okay. Cyphery. Okay. You should spark ball, press down the input and ability. You like you throw the ball in the direction you're facing. Right? Your key injury. Okay. Saboteur. Melee dual wield skill. Sight saboteur. Melee dual wield skill equipped to different one hand weapons. Okay. Sentinel. Your base armor is increased by 10. Mercenary. I feel like we're going to go mercenary. Yeah. Mercenary chosen. Okay, here we go. Wait, why is my critical ascent chance down to four? Oh. So mercenary is that. Wait. Yeah, why does it say just four there? Mercenary chosen. Yeah, that's weird. Like it wasn't loading. Okay. Anyway. That'll work. Here we go. Here's somebody with a troubled past, drawn into the spotlight of a story that's already begun. Okay. We're already at a crossroads. Choosing a path in life is that fork in the road where you make a choice or simply stop living. Okay. But for you, it's not only a crossroad, but a choice. A reflection of your key, the primal energy that flows through everything. Mm. Color me a light for freedom and loyalty. I'm dark as in strength and power. Ooh. I'll say freedom and loyalty. Let me introduce myself. I'm the light and bright side of you, or your inner voice to be precise. An echo of balance and consequence of your actions as you move forward. Gotcha. I'm bright. Seems more like you're being lightheaded if you ask me, but you'll come around eventually. But what comes around goes all the way back around. It's better to stick to your instincts. You can't fight what's in your nature. In your nature? And here I was hoping we'd be all about natural selection, survival of the strongest, and so forth. And that's not instinct, and I don't know what is. Okay. <laughs> natural selection is all about evolution and progress. And as soon as there's enough light, darkness will disappear. Oh, that's right, okay. My aura. Right is always right. Okay. Oh. Stories of death and the bodies left behind. A reminder that we're at the mercy of nature, and the one that preys on others. Okay. Do you remember the beast that shattered your family? Or did you choose to forget? You turned your back on our world, and got lost in your own. Meanwhile, the predator only grew stronger. Mm. 
Uh-oh. Oh, didn't do that. Oh. Ow. this okay viper bite okay rabbit's fury okay to end this story. Uh oh. This is literally like the cutscene, okay. Loading screen. This time, it was best to run and live to fight another day. Let us hope you're ready for it when it comes. Okay. Okay. So here I am in the here. The predator isn't the only threat. Oh, the okay. wildlife started to mutate when the end of days began, and the tree of life started to die. Move towards an enemy and target them with melee attacks. In the current enemy with ranged attacks. Reload your range and press R1. You can use your dodging and your mutations. Yeah. Okay, so where's he at? Okay, beat him. We're going to turn up the volume just a little bit. I got it down quite a bit. Okay. Just want to see what's over here real quick. Nope, nothing. Okay, now let's get out of here. Okay. Explore bucket. Okay. Do I actually have ammo? Oh, okay, electric module. Open special effect add on, add it to your range weapon, give it an extra damage with only single last, and it's resistance. Okay. To add touch special on select. Press and hold. Wait, how do how did I say do that? It said press and hold up. Okay. That's what I have on. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what I did there. Oh, there we go. Oh, and I already equipped the electrical thing to it. Okay. 
Axiom Medical. Nice. You can use advantage by holding the quick select menu input and selecting it. Okay. I don't need it right now though. What's in here? Equip that. An energy pack, okay. Pick up. Nice. Let's go. How do you. Oh, like that. Okay. The oil sludge is everywhere. The most, it only means death. But some have adapted to the new environment and changed the evolution as it was. Remember to parry attacks when an enemy attacks you see lightning. Oh. Combat a little bit. Following means can often be looted. Okay, we use a healing item to remove tap selection. Okay. What's this? Oh, okay, armor. Or, uh, junk. Don't want to go in the sludge. Oh crap. Oh, dang it. Okay, come on. Better at that. Health pack. Okay. Yeah, no, I really gotta get better at combat. Okay. That's only happen after time, though, so it's fine. Fighting area. Oh, thought it would have been. Hmm. I don't see anything. I want to say there's a way to like scan for stuff. Oh, that's run. Okay. Where? Iron wall. Somebody's going to carry large shields. You need to break the shield with melee attacks where you can deal damage to the enemy. Okay, easy enough. There we go.
Oh crap. XP. Okay. Not bad. Let's level up. Love you. Increase the attribute. Choice by 10. Pick whichever you want to increase. Oh, we're definitely going to go luck. I want that loot chance. Oh. Close combat. Select the weapon type you want to unlock for the first special attack for. Dual wield melee. Square, square, triangle. Oh. Let's do it. So, square, square, triangle. So, square, 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 square. X square. square. Okay, yeah. Cool. Do you have other points where we some perks? Cool. We don't have any here. Maneuvers. Oh, okay. And perks. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, let's keep looking around. Can't go that way. Okay. Look, an emergency box from the once was a rare sight. Okay. I'm assuming that's going to be a new weapon, right? That's a tool, gotcha. Okay. Does the crowbar let you open locked chests or is it locked doors? I can't remember. That pipe looks weak. The claw bar should come in handy. Oh, okay. What the heck does the claw bar do? How do I use it? Pry the pipe. Ah, oh, gotcha, okay. So just certain things will be able to be used for that, gotcha. Here we go. Whoa. It's time to find a way out of this place. No, really, I mean it. Okay. over there. Uh-oh. Oh, crap. I didn't realize that was bad. Yep. Restart last checkpoint. Whoops. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Don't fall on that. You'll die. Easy enough. Hey, what the heck? Can't remember what these things are. Oh, I think I'm supposed to shoot that, right? The Morks produce biomatter in their multi and they shed under this space. Lots that affect the special text. Remember from your search attack possible search text are prompted in the lower right hand corner of the screen, pressing the little control to do your special attack. Cellular code spreads of any living being when absorbed, including you.
cool, cool, cool. Mutations. Use your bottles and electrical powers anytime I can. Okay. So we got three bio points. Can't we destroy this? Nope. Okay, I just want to make sure there's no chests or anything real quick. Yeah, nothing that I can see. Okay, let's do the bio thing real quick. Uh, mutations. Get the mutation of side powers unlock. Okay. So we can do upgrade resistance. Oh. Psi powers. We can't do. Oh, we can't do that. Biogenetics we can do, though. Moth mouth. And vile bile. Uh. No, I'm good. I want to go resistance. Let's do. I say let's do biohazard. Biohazard. Let's just go straight up biohazard. Because I think that's whenever you start, like that's the first thing that you run into. Um, biogenetics, fungi. So the fungi you actually do need eventually. Um, not storm hop. The bubble, yeah, you want as well. That helps with moving around. Uh, yes, yeah, so the fungi is what we'll try and get next. Psy powers, blaze, blink, sizzle ball, freeze, levitate. That one's not so bad either. Yeah, we'll worry about those later. Okay. Wait, why does it say... I was like, gear? I have new gear? Inventor... Oh, consumable. Gotcha. Okay. I think I can save at any time, right? Yeah, cool. Awesome, I love games that you can save at any time. Okay, nothing here. Okay. Toxin all built vessels called arcs to save themselves from the impending doom. But was it too late? It is only from the flight logs of the single Ark they left behind that we know other Arks traveled through the sky and beyond. It seems those that came before us never lost hope in finding a new home for their kind. Gotcha. Okay. Okay, we can do this. Found a puzzle. They're scattered in the world, so it opens new path features, different rewards. Okay. Press R1 to rotate. The number of rotations you have left for the higher your intellect. Oh, the number of, this is the number of rotations you have left. The higher your intellect, the more moves you have here. Okay. To complete the puzzle, running out of moves where that may have consequences. Oh, okay. Okay, so if we go. That one's good. That one's good. little movie there are few records of the chain of events that led to the big apocalypse eons ago but it's clear the world wasn't prepared for how recklessly the toxinol corporation would make its mark on the world their rare earth mining and nuclear industries generated tons of waste and without consideration for the future they dumped it all in landfills until they ran out of space that's when they made the big mistake they began dumping the toxic waste in the surf just off the coast instead assuming that it would sink and decay with time and they were right but no one was prepared for what was about to unfold. Once in the surf, the radiation interfered with the genetics of the wildlife and created bizarre mutations in their offspring. 
It had an inconceivable impact on biodiversity and the entire ecosystem. The world as they knew it crumbled as nature retaliated. It would never be the same again, and what remained of it became ours. Gotcha, okay. Let's keep going. The sound of spark metal going pew pew is never a good thing. It's coming from behind that door. Gotcha. A warning label. The box looks like a potential brain melt. Okay. What does that mean, though? It's going oh, to take a okay. bit of puzzling to short circuit the door. There you go. Here we go. Perfectly counting enemy will stun them. Stunned enemy has star circling with their head, and hitting enemy again, you can launch up in the air by pressing L1. The wheeled one is outnumbered. You'd better help him out. Okay, let's do it. Yeah. Good night, okay. That's the last of them. Let's talk to the wheeled one before backup arrives. Give me a second, let me loot all this stuff real quick. There are a lot of bodies here. Energy pack, okay. Okay, it looks like all of them. See what he says. He wants to thank you for taking his side against the scavengers. He sounds familiar. You just can't figure out why. He presents himself as out of date. He knows he's way overdue, but he hasn't given up. He doesn't seem surprised that you don't recognize him. You were just a child back then. The night, everything changed. There have been rumors of a one-eyed Ronin seen outside the Great Wall, and he's happy to see it's true. The legend of the one-eyed child that grew up as an outcast is old and sad. The child could have been anyone, but the evil it had fled had left a mark. A facial scar to remember the past. There's no doubt you're the child, and that what Lupa Lupin did to your village, your Moomer and Popsy, was the beginning of the end. 
I do. Our yeah, yeah. He says it has taken you a long time to bring the past back up to the present to find your way back. But he's grateful you have. You bar dollo It was after the attack that the unity fell apart. Your Muma's disciples divided and formed tribes as a reaction to the blight that had fallen upon the land. Had it not been for the Tree of Life, no one would have survived. He hopes you at least remember the tree. Oh, here we go. I do find that in advance when we see the tower. Okay. Let's see. So this is me remembering back then. Asks if you were tired, as it's a bit of a hike here from the village. He wonders if your Mooma knows you are here. I hope I told her. You're such a good child, so you probably did. Even the young forget. He understands why you came all the way out here. To see them, the potato people. The potato people, or Nono, are a wonder somehow interlinked with this little tree here fueling its source of life. You might be right. Like potatoes, they're packed with energy, an excellent source of key. The Nono prefer to hide in glitter grass. He says you should get over there and ruffle it. See if you can make one come out of hiding. Okay. How do you ruffle it? Oh. You found one. You should be proud. They don't come out for everyone. Where is it? The Nono's key energy is just what the Pensai needs to complete its cycle and grow into a tree of life. <laughs> Only time will tell. At least his intention is to dedicate his life to it. He has the feeling the fate of the world depends on it. You need to support the tree for a long time to come. The only way it'll grow tall is with the burst of key released from the Nono as they become one with the tree. You'll need a net to catch the Nono, and he wants you to use his, but asks you to be gentle. The Nono are sensitive beings, an embodiment of key, the primal energy. Okay. Hoop net, okay. Where's it at? Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. You handle that net like you've never done anything else. He's impressed. One day, he hopes the tree will have grown tall enough to sustain the world. But today, your focus is getting this one to become one with the tree. Okay. So what am I doing here? Now that you've seen the Nono's connection with the tree with your own eyes, you have no reason to doubt. From this day on, he'll make nurturing the Pensai into a tree of life, a life goal. Not only for our village's sake, but for all of us, everyone. One day, the land won't be as peaceful. 
Not even your Mooma will be able to protect us. He says you'd better hurry back to the village before your Mooma comes looking for you. You did good here today. Yeah, I shouldn't make her worry. No, she's got lots on her mind and needs rest after the raid last night on the Lupin camp with her disciples. Wonders if they let the Predator family live or not. He lost you there for a while, but no memory is alone. It's part of a trail you can follow. He says he remembers every single day he devoted to growing the Tree of Life, but now he's afraid it might be in vain. The tree started to die when the end of days begun, and it wasn't long after that that the World Eaters arrived. The World Eaters. The genetic evolution that occurred after the apocalypse the Toxinol Corporation inflicted on the land set the World Eaters' DNA into overdrive. His friend Gizmo is working on a Mekton and needs help defeating the Jumbo Puff at the end of the West Route. Okay. Wiz is still repairing his octopod to confront the Merc Puff that dwells deep down under the surface at the end of the Northwest Route. Noko has tamed the Majut and is preparing to take on the Hoof Puff at the end of the East Route. Finally, Goop is almost done with the Goo Glide. A machine able to ride the waves of the surf all the way out to the Porky Puff at the end of the route to the southeast. <laughs> out of date, says his friends, are gearing up to stop the World Eaters. There's one at the end of each route. The road ahead won't be easy, but he's counting on your support. His friends aren't strong enough to end this on their own. He wants you to understand that you'll all die if the tree isn't saved. Regardless, you'll meet again once you've played your part in the tribe war and the situation with the world eaters. Nice. Okay. So, I think it's going to have us leave now. Let's go ahead and call it here. Uh, so, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.